Have you ever wondered how crucial global communication is and how people achieved it in the past? Imagine a time when communication wasn't as easy as tapping a few keys on your smartphone. In the 19th century, the telegraph revolutionized the way people sent messages over long distances. This technology, invented by the likes of Samuel Morse, transformed electric signals into a coded language of dots and dashes, known today as Morse code. In 1844, Morse himself sent the first telegraphic message from Washington DC to Baltimore, marking a significant milestone in communication history. Yet, this achievement posed another question. How could people send messages across the vast expanse of the ocean? The only method available was by ship, a journey that could take weeks, even months. The idea of a transatlantic telegraph cable began to take root. The dream was to connect continents, and one man dared to make this dream a reality, American businessman Cyrus Westfield. In 1856, Field founded the Atlantic Telegraph Company, a venture that would embark on an ambitious project. This was the year when Cyrus Westfield, a visionary business tycoon, decided to make the dream of transatlantic communication a reality. Gathering support from both the American and British governments, he set the wheels in motion. His team included two British engineers, Charles Bright and John Brett, who were tasked with the design and manufacture of the cable. The cable, a marvel of Victorian engineering, was constructed from copper wires coated with gutta percha, a natural form of rubber for insulation. Iron wires were then wrapped around for protection. This hefty cable, weighing in at over a thousand tons, stretched for about 2,000 miles. Field's fleet, the HMS Agamemnon and the USS Niagara, made their first attempt to lay the cable in 1857. Unfortunately, the cable broke, sinking into the deep abyss of the Atlantic Ocean. Despite the setback, Field and his team persisted leading to a second attempt in 1858. 1858 marked a significant year in the history of global communication. This was the year when the audacious project of laying a transatlantic telegraph cable finally bore fruit. After a failed attempt in 1857, the Atlantic Telegraph Company successfully laid a cable stretching from Valentia Island in Ireland to Heart's Content in Newfoundland. This was no small feat, the cable was over 2,000 miles long, weighed over a 1,000 tons, and lay at the bottom of the Atlantic Ocean. The first official message sent through this cable was a letter of congratulations from Queen Victoria to President James Buchanan. This transatlantic conversation, which would have taken weeks by ship, took just 17 hours and 40 minutes to transmit due to the low speed and poor quality of the cable. However, the joy of this monumental achievement was short-lived. After just three weeks, the cable ceased to function. The culprit, excessive voltage applied by Edward Orange Wildman Whitehouse, who had attempted to improve the signal, coupled with poor manufacturing and handling of the cable. The harsh ocean environment didn't help matters either. The failure was a major disappointment, but it didn't spell the end for transatlantic telegraphy. Instead, it served as a stepping stone for future technological advancements. It taught valuable lessons in persistence and innovation. Lessons that would eventually lead to the successful establishment of a permanent telegraphic connection between Europe and America. The initial failure was a setback, but it paved the way for a more successful endeavor. In 1866, eight years after the initial attempt, a new and improved telegraph cable was laid across the Atlantic. This time, the project was a resounding success. Using the ship SS Great Eastern, the largest ship of its time, the Atlantic Telegraph Company was able to establish a faster, stronger, and more reliable connection between Europe and America. This successful transatlantic telegraph cable was not just a technological triumph. It marked the dawn of a new era in global communication. For the first time, messages could be sent across continents in mere minutes instead of weeks or months. This revolutionized not only how people communicated, but also how they perceived the world. Distances that once seemed insurmountable were now easily bridged, bringing the far ends of the earth closer together. The telegraph cable had a profound impact on politics, economics and social relations across the Atlantic. 
It facilitated faster diplomatic communication between governments, accelerated international trade, and fostered a sense of global community. The world seemed a little smaller, a little more connected. The legacy of the first transatlantic telegraph cable lives on in today's world of instant global communication. The challenges faced, the failures endured, and the eventual success of this ambitious project serve as a testament to human ingenuity and determination. The first transatlantic telegraph cable was indeed a challenge, a failure and a success that forever changed the course of history.